From over 10,000 applicants, six have been chosen for a once in a lifetime opportunity. It's the job interview nightmares are made of. I'm very tough. I don't take any nonsense from anybody. If you give me business, I'll make a million pounds. In your business, you need someone sharp and cool and flash like me. I'm the best businessman in the world. <laughs> They're after a job worth £100,000, with a boss famously hard to please. Will you stick to what you bloody know? You wouldn't work for me if that's your mentality. This is Sir Alan Sugar. This is not a game. I promise you, my friend, you would be out that door so quick, you wouldn't know what's hit you. At 18, all he had was a white van and a hundred quid. Now he's got a vast empire and six ambitious grandchildren. Famous for Amstrad and the chairmanship of Spurs, Sir Alan's now got all the toys he wants. Tough and straight talking, he's on the hunt for a new apprentice. And he's willing to pay big pocket money. All I'm looking for is somebody who is drop-dead true. This is a job interview from hell. Over the next 60 years, these young hopefuls will have to prove their worth. Six candidates, one vacancy. You totally misread it. Why shouldn't I fire you for this task? I'm really good at football. I'm not a loser, I'm a winner. If it's you and me in business, Sir Alan, it'll be six love, six love and six love. I don't need people that create aggravation. You're one of the youngest people I've ever had. It was quite clear what the task was all about. And you didn't do that. I cut the onions up and I took the potato. No, I cut the potatoes. No, I cut the tomatoes up. You went out and lost me money. You're fired. You're fired. You are a total shambles. You're fired. 